hello, hello. Happy Sunday. Okay, so my voice is a little bit better today. And I went ahead and did pretty much a full face from eyes to mascara, eyeliner, and everything. Except for... I didn't... Oops, wrong way. <laughs> I didn't put any foundation or anything on yet. Just my primer. So we're going to go ahead and put this on to show the difference that it makes. So you can see... Here, let me bring you guys all up close and stuff in here. So you can see the dark circles under my eyes. Obviously, my sleeping pattern is a little bit off. Um, I'm still a little congested, but we're going to go ahead and this is going to pull the whole entire look together. So I'm going to show you how quick a foundation routine can be. Whoop, knock a whole bunch of stuff over. Um, so let me just pin my website real quick. I'm coming on late, but I really was just lounging today and uh, doing work from, from my couch. Okay. So when you guys are popping on, say hi. Let me know how you're doing, what you're doing. Don't make me sit here and talk to myself. You know I do that anyway. Pin and pinned. Okay, I'm like way in the comments. All right, hold on. Ooh. I'm like in my comfies. Hi, Carolyn. How are you, babe? How's your weekend? All right, so there we go. Ooh, my ankle popped. That felt good. Okay, so you can see like my freckles, like everything. I'm going to try not to ruin my eyebrows. I don't even know why I did them, but I figured if I'm going to show a full face, we're going to just do it. So I'm going to use the Touch Liquid Foundation that is in our um, kudos for this month. So this stuff is amazing. And if you really need extra hydration or you think your skin is too dry for it, just grab yourself a BB cream too while you're at it. It's 100% worth every bit of the money you're going to spend. And you can just mix the two together because... Um, BB cream is really, really hydrating. All right, I already mixed this up before, so this should be fine. Okay. Ooh, squeezed it out. I'm going to put about one, two, three, four. Oh, hold up. I see a fuzz. You're not welcome. I don't want you there. There we go. We'll do like five drops. And if you need more, we'll add more. Okay. So... All I'm adding is this onto my BB cream that I already have. So in the kudos, you're going to get your primer, your concealer, your liquid foundation, and your choice of a setting powder or setting spray. And we're just going to put this all over and then literally just buff it in. It feels so super light. Somebody asked me the other day, like, well, is it heavy? Because some foundations are heavy or thick, and this is not at all. It literally, I almost went over my eye makeup I just did. Um, it literally doesn't feel like you're putting anything on. It's like so smooth, and it just, it feels amazing. Blend it right down your neck. And all your little crevices. This stuff is literally like, I'm going to go around my eyebrows here. It's like Photoshop in a bottle. And it's so lightweight. And that's why it's popular. So popular. And that's why it's in this month's kudos, which only happens once a year. And it's the biggest savings that they have. It's like a 32% savings with this bundle. And they added on because we just came out with the foundation stick, which three shades have already sold out. They are unavailable right now because it's super popular. Being a brand new foundation stick, um, you can add on a foundation stick and a kabuki brush, which is also brand new, for a total of $158. So you can do the regular bundle of the four products for $99, or you can add on the bonus plus for the extra two items for uh, $158, which is a good saving still because the um, kabuki brush is $32 and... It's 39 for the foundation stick. So if you guys do the math, it's huge, huge, huge savings. Okay, blending this all in, I'm going to take, just because you guys know I love this extra step, this is dry. It's just a little blending bud, and I'm just going to press it all in. Um, the liquid foundation does dry to a matte powder finish. So this is really just an extra step. You don't have to do it, but I highly recommend it. And I can't see anything. I did not put my contacts in because I wouldn't be able to breathe. I'm getting too old for this going out business. 
<laughs> we went out two days in a row for his birthday and I didn't even barely drink or anything, but just the staying up late and the constant talking and the loudness, you know, you got to talk over everybody. I was like, I don't have a voice anymore. As of yesterday, I was just like, I, was, I felt like I was beat up. So it sounds worse than it is. Like, I'm not, I don't feel like, I feel sorry. <laughs> yesterday, I was just exhausted. Yesterday, it hurt almost to talk just because I was so congested from not having a voice. And you know me. I'm going to talk anyway and go right over my eyebrows. All right. I think we are all blended in, but check out that coverage. My darkness of my eyes went away. All my freckles are gone. If you want more coverage, just mix the concealer that comes with it because you get to pick out a concealer. Just mix a little couple concealer drops in, mix it right in with your foundation or you can do it separate any way you want to do it. Um, my goal is to sell 10 and then, um, I can also win a ring light from unique for being a presenter, but my goal was to do that anyway, because I'm shooting for pink this month and I'm trying to do like a status upgrade. So, um, I have a friend that actually messaged me tonight who's interested in the kudos kit. So I'm going to help her out tomorrow. And I told her she's going to love it. And it feels like nothing is on. It's so silky smooth. And I don't look like I have anything on. I mean, obviously the rest of my makeup and everything. But this part makes your skin just look flawless. So then I'm going to just take, I'm not even going to add any other bronzers or anything today. You could use the setting powder. I used that in, I think it was yesterday's video. So today I'm going to use the setting spray. So you get the choice of the two. It's a hard decision for me. Because I really like them both. So I would say to get both. But if you're just going to get one really a personal preference or depending on with the the weather changing thanks babe um to maybe go with the setting powder but it really is a personal preference so i always say pick one and you could always add on the other or you could just come back and get it your next time around because anytime people try this they are like oh my god this is amazing and i love it and i said i know i i don't tell you guys this just for fun. I don't come on here every day because I'm trying to, it's because I love it. It works that well. And it shows you how well it works. If you see my video from the other day, I put Sharpie marker, black Sharpie marker on an X on this side and a heart on this side and the same amount of drops and it covered it right up. It will cover up anything. I'm going to try it on my tattoo. It's, I was trying to figure out how I could do it on camera because it's on my ankle but I'm going to try to figure it out or I'll make him record it or something to show that it literally covers up like anything. And you have your concealer too that can, you can use as a cover up. But the foundation alone covers up everything. I mean, if it can cover up a Sharpie black marker on my face, it can cover up whatever imperfections you guys all have that you don't like. And we all have something we don't like. So that's why if it's, Oh, I don't wear makeup or I'm not a big fan of makeup. Okay, it takes two seconds, though. Put a couple drops of this on. You still don't look like you have anything on. You don't feel like you have anything on, but you're going to feel more confident. You're going to walk a little taller, and you're going to probably get compliments, and that's going to boost up your morale and everything, and that's what I want. I want to empower and make everybody feel beautiful, especially on the days that we don't, and makeup does that for me, so... This is, let me grab them right here, one, two, where's my primer? Here's what you get for $99, you get your four essential products, and you can, if you don't want to get the um, translucent setting powder, you can switch it out, you do have the option to get the setting spray. So it's automatically these three, and then your choice out of these two so you can do a setting powder or setting spray and that's where it's personal preference because I really like both of them I usually use the setting powder and the setting spray together um, I do find sometimes with humidity or certain weather the setting powder is gonna last a little bit longer but that's what I mean you got to play around with it so it is about personal preference and trial and error so that's why I say just buy them both <laughs> save yourself the trouble when all else fails and you can't decide get them both so that is my response to most everything. Probably why I have so much makeup, so much jewelry, so many flip-flops and shoes. 
your girl's got a problem, but that's okay. If it makes you feel good, go for it. That's all that matters. All right, I am going to hop off here before, oh, 